All April long, we've talked about autism and how this year advocates are shifting focus from awareness to acceptance. So what exactly does Autism Acceptance Month mean? A short answer would be trying to understand and know who people with autism are. And it's helpful to understand when you hear from a person with autism. Brianna Volz is here now with an inspirational story from ClickO. Well, Bridget, on his website, Tips for Inclusion, Timothy Rower opens up about hurdles he faced as a young person with autism. After dealing with exclusion by his peers over the years, Rower, a now young adult who was diagnosed with autism as a second grader, penned and published a pamphlet in which he basically guides people on how to treat those with disabilities. So we thought we'd share some of his guidance with you. So first, if you see someone who is different from you, it could mean they have a disability. Do not be afraid of them. They just want to be like everyone else. Be polite, introduce yourself, talk to them, and ask some questions. Next, if they're having a hard time doing something, like maybe opening a door, offer to help them with it. If someone is in a wheelchair and they need help getting around, offer to move them. Just be sure to ask permission first before you just move them. Lastly, here's an important one for parents to pass along to kids who may have a classmate or a friend who has a disability. Be sure to spend time with them outside of school. Invite them to come over for a play date or maybe for a party or invite them to spend time with you and your group of friends to the park, the movies, or invite them bowling. Rower's mother says her son's guidance has gotten remarkable response and that he's reached a really big audience. The pamphlet has even landed Rower appearances on some national talk shows. So what an inspiring young man. Now for his guide, plus links to his website and Facebook page, we have that for you over on clickorlando.com.